What exactly is a pneumatic controller? A pneumatic controller is a mechanical device that measures a process variable and sends a corrective air signal to the final control element. What are the main parts of a process loop controller? Receiver, error detector and control amplifier. What is receiver? The receiver converts the signal from the process variable, flow, pressure, level, temperature, etc. into a signal which is suitable for the controller operating system. What is error detector? The error detector detects any difference between the measured process variable, measured value and the set point, desired value. What is control amplifier? The output signal to the correcting unit is adjusted by this unit. Up until the error signal is reduced to zero, the correcting unit continues to make corrections. The control amplifier maintains the correcting unit in a fixed position when there is no error. The system can be switched to manual mode, allowing the operators to manually change the output signal. From closed, percent, to maximum, 100%, the output signal is displayed as a percentage. Calibration Procedures of Pneumatic Controller First, calibrate the indicator. Check the manipulate of controller. Adjust the PV pointer by adjusting 0 and span. 0%, 25 percent, 50%, 75%, 100%. We should put the PV pointer and the set point pointer in the center, then put the proportional band and reset to maximum. So, output will be slow. Check the set point by moving the pointer to percent down and up. The right angle of PV link should be 90 degree from up and down. Remove PV link and put the PV in mid scale. Apply supply pressure 1.4 bars. After that move the set point pointer in any direction. Output gauge should be 0.6 bars. Put the proportional band to 0 and move the set point pointer. Put the proportional band 0.6 bars. That means output 0.6 bar, minimum and maximum both. Move the set point pointer in anywhere and adjust set point knob to 0.6 bars, which means output should be 0.6 bar. By set point adjustment. Move the proportional band to black selector. If the supply less, you can adjust the output by flapper adjustment. Before that, remove the proportional band lock by inserting the screwdriver through the hole. Check the minimum proportional band 0.6 bars and checks one maximum 0.6 bar. If less or high adjust thump wheel adjustment that is behind the proportional band. If both 0.6 bar the controller is ok. After calibration to make sure. Put the proportional band on 100 then put the reset on 50% or fine. Both minimum and move the set point pointer if it give this range the controller is ok. 0% 0.2 25% 0.4 50% 0.6 75% 0.8 100% 1 1.0 .1 All this calibration steps should be auto mode. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, share, comment. IIQA